Hey guys, what's up? This is place the Wolfen and throughout the year I have been reviewing movies from the 2000s which I did watch back when they were recent. This is not one of those movies. It's a movie that was released in the 2000s but I've never actually seen it until today. In fact, I knew nothing about it aside from the fact that it exists. And it's yet another movie taking place in World War II about the Nazis. Now this is overton as hell, but there is a good reason why so many movies are made on that time period. Because honestly, it's one of the most important parts of history. And everybody needs to be educated about that, so we learn not to do the mistakes people did back then. Anyway, it's basically about a family that fears the Nazis. And it's perfectly reasonable, because they were fucking scary back then. Now I'm gonna talk about the characters. First I'm gonna talk about Vladislav Spillman, played by Adrian Brody. I would do apologies in advance if I mispronounced any of the names. So I don't speak the language, doing that is unfortunately unavoidable. Anyway, he's a fucking pianist. That's basically his personality trait. And it's a damn good one. The reason why he's able to escape the Nazis so easily in this movie is because he's a fucking entertainer. And entertainers are needed. But it still is fucking scary. They need to be an entertainer to get a free pass. He's of course as good as the rest of the family. Which is understandable. Now his father is Samuel Spillman, played by Frank Finlay. Now he's a good man and very rational. Yeah, there isn't anything else I can say about him honestly. I just really like him, he's a cool father. Now then, there is the third and final character to talk about. Instead, a group of characters I wanna talk about, and that's the fucking Nazis. You know, those Nazis make me very fucking angry. They burst into people's houses, take them away, or kill them for paying fucking Jews. These Nazis make me fucking sick. Seriously, fuck them. But while I was angry, I was also sad at the same time, and very scared. Nobody has a chance to escape from the Nazis, which is very fucking frightening. In fact, movies based on real tragic events are far scarier to me than most horror movies. Because the fact that it really happened is far scarier to think about as some random monster killing characters that are totally fictional. Although it is a bit scary, I don't feel much when a fictional character gets killed by a monster. Of course I feel something when the fictional characters are good, but I feel a lot more pain when I see a movie based on an actual tragic event, such as the Holocaust. It's really scary to just think about it. Now it's time for my overall thoughts. Honestly, not only do I like this movie, I also think it's one of the best movies about World War II and the Nazis. It would be on my top 5 for sure, and for that I'm gonna give the rating 2 thumbs up. I must warn you though, this movie is very tough to sit through. It's not a fun movie in the slightest. Nothing is fun about the Holocaust. So if you want to watch this movie, just bear in mind that it's far from fun. Here is the end of the video, thank you for watching and have a great day.